My first day here, my family came with me. It was a mixture of excitement and just, you know, apprehension. Like coming here, I think I made a lot of memories um, that are really important for me. I, it was like I was a newborn, newborn baby here. Like I need to know how to order the food. Like I need to, I need to know like how to take the pu public transportation. That's, that's sort of hard here. It was scary, but it was, I don't know, the thrill, I guess. It, was, it, was, it wasn't too bad. I used to have like friends problem here because like I came here alone and uh, and uh, the friends who I played with before they they didn't come here so it's like it's like a total new environment for me. I made new friends. I became so close to American culture and um, like just experiencing this new life is definitely something amazing for me. Adjusting to the new culture was, um, well, it's hard to say because it was not difficult, but it was also not easy. I think it's tricky because you think German culture and American culture is very much alike because they're both Western cultures. But then when you get here, you see those subtle differences. And then it's like, then you have to get used to it. Initially, adjusting to the new culture was kind of difficult for me because of so many differences, like new set of people, like even like, in our culture, when we talk to people, we usually don't make eye contacts, but here it's like all over, like looking in the eyes and being confident and like saying what you believe and stuff like that. Maybe America's a little bit more like peaches, like, you know, like soft surface. It's like easier to maybe get to know them and, you know, they're friendly, but then when you get at the core, it's like harder to get through there. Like it's harder to take that step and know that I found a true friend. Whereas in other cultures, and I'd say Germany is one of one of those, I forgot what the comparison was. Maybe a walnut or an apple, like something that's like harder to like get into. But once you're close to someone, you know you know you found a true friend to rely on. In the first few weeks, I kind of miss my family and all my friends because everything's back there, and I just moved to a new place. It was a bit like difficult to get adjusted to it, but after a while I made new friends here. Back in Germany, I'll be homesick for LA. Like you create your own new homes, all of, like that's my experience, like wherever you go. I get homesick when I'm alone and just sitting in my apartment by myself. Um, but other than that, I usually go out and I don't, I keep like interacting myself and like keep myself busy all the time. And uh, I would suggest like to everyone, I would recommend like just taking a comfort item from home. That's a pillow or I don't know, maybe a frame with like a picture in it. I think everyone should have a picture with like friends or family on it here. Like I would say international students who are struggling at the moment, like talk with people, make more friends, be friendly, go out with them, hang out. And they're really nice people and they would always help you out. Don't be shy. That's like the first thing I would say because here you just need to be like to be confident in yourself. Um, a lot of people like uh, people who are like confident in themselves and they know what they're doing. So and definitely yeah, confidence and um, try to like make new friends. Don't be just stuck with you with your old friends who speak the same language as you do. Don't be afraid to be rejected. Um, people probably won't, and if they do, whatever, next, like not worth your time. International Center hosts a lot of different programs so that um, international students can improve their English and also make friends with, um, as well as domestic and um, international, I mean, domestic and international students. If anyone is in need, I would absolutely recommend um, using the counseling center because they want you to go there. They're even on campus and asking you to get informed and see what they offer. They, um, they have IPG program mentors. Um, those people usually help you with everything that you need. If you need just to talk to someone or if you want to know, like get more information about on-campus resources, um, they usually help you. It's like your mentor. It's, it's made for the international students. It's like a place where you can go to for more information 
about what you should do as an international student and what you can do, what are your rights and what are the facilities available to you. I think I've seen they offer um, classes for you know stress relief or um, even if you, you struggle academically or personally, whether that's family issues, dating issues, um, problems with friends, whatever it is, they have people there that you can talk to. I think in my culture, we don't really seek out for help when it comes to mental stuff. Singapore is still pretty much on the conservative side when it comes to mental health. That's not something anyone would really talk about. Back home, I don't really think we give pri priority to our mental health that much, but here it seems like a very important issue because maybe because of the pressure and everything. But over here, just people are just more open about it and more inclined to ex share their feelings, so I think it's, it's a more like, acceptable topic to talk about here. I would consider going to the counseling center if I'm like not doing well or having a hard time living here. And like in the, stu uh, the health center, they also have some psychologists who would help you. Yeah, I would choose to go to the campus counseling center if I have problems for myself. Because they are very helpful and they are friendly to me if I go there. I'm pretty sure about that. Of course, it's, there are going to be times that you think you'd rather be home, you miss certain things, people are giving you a hard time, or assignments are just giving you a hard time. But just keep in mind that that's temporarily, most likely, this is going to pass, and then, and then you're going to take off again and have a great time here. And then you also struggle at home. It's not like home is the happy place. You intend to think that when you're somewhere else, but you, you have struggles and, and hopefully like also like you know happy times everywhere so just stick with it and, and embrace the opportunity. For more information or if you'd like to speak to someone about yourself, a friend or loved one, call Counseling and Psychological Services at 209-228-4266 24 hours a day or email us directly 